Time Splitters 2. I love this game! We. Oui. I mean, we Really? Hi guys, and welcome to Fire Button. And uh, today, we are playing... What are we playing, Steve? Well, it's simple, really. Give it By a minute. simple, I mean top of the screen. Yeah. <laughs> Goldeneye. Yes. <laughs> well, it's made by some of the same guys, the Free Radical guys. It's uh, Time Splitters 2. Rather than doing some intense multiplayer action, though, I'm picking the snowy level because we're near Christmas. Woohoo! Yay, Christmas. Yeah. Yes, uh, that, that time of year when people are all excited about presents and the gifts of giving. Steve, when is this video going to be launched? Um, Probably. After. Uh, probably <laughs> after Christmas. <laughs> uh, or... I might. It, it, it depends, really. It depends on certain situations, but most likely will be out either Christmas Eve or if it's not out on Christmas Eve, a little later, perhaps Christmas Ooh. Day, perhaps Boxing Day, perhaps the Sunday thereafter, like normal. Perhaps okay. next Saturday. But anyway, to the game on screen, we have Nikolai, and uh, I believe his name is Sergeant Light. Slate. No, that's the undead version. Sergeant Chill, something uh, like that. They. Uh, Russian commandos in the base of a dam checking out things being all badass and stuff. Is that why they're wearing life jackets? That's why they're wearing life jackets. I think they're meant to be tactical vests, but the way Time Splitters is designed, you know. I love the graphics on this. It's very caricature. Yes. FMV! Mm. And, uh, yeah. For trivia purposes, what's this game Damn. about? This game is about thwarting the Time Splitters, and the main character, our hero, uh, the uh, pitch black Vin Diesel knockoff there, Quantum leaps into people and becomes this lady here. Now, if you had that power, what would you do? Well, I don't think he gets to choose. He merely goes to places, does a mission, nicks a time crystal, buggers off. So he couldn't strip down naked right there and then. You have left a, sh left a sh you have led a sheltered life, haven't you? Maybe. Right, okay. <laughs> Continue. Right. This particular mission also seems to be a channeling golden eye, like. The first mission of Goldeneye is assaulting a dam. Instead, it's assaulting a dam, but going inside the dam and below it, as opposed to just staying in the upper part and jumping off. Also, do not forget to blow up the communication dish. Yeah, in the practice run for this level, I actually missed out the first objective, and as a result, we were fruitlessly trying to destroy it from the top of the dam, because we were now boxed in by zombies. It looks like they're going through renovations anyway. Yeah, or they're conveniently left planks everywhere. Got good wood. Oh, oh, oh Steve. Yeah. It's I like snowing how this and tunnel, everything. there is conveniently just two guns just dropped on the floor waiting for oh, me. Oh, happens all the time. If you're in a military installation, there's just guns dripping around everywhere. Yeah. Especially in Russia. And that was the whole golden eye leading. It's the only mission that does that. You know, it all flows around to the back of your head. Right then, let's get the show on the road. Oh. oh. Sniping was extremely tedious when I was playing this game. Aww. Sad camera. Sad camera is sad because I just poked its eye out with a sniper rifle. Okay, so this it looks quite a stealthy thing, but can you go in and just kind of do? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just doing it this way because it's just the way I, I, I played the level when I was a kid. You know, sneaking around. It's the only real mission where stealth is a massive factor in gameplay. A lot of it's more run and gun. It's li I think there's a little bit more design put into it than just go here, shoot all the guys. I have been detected. So stealth in the uh, blood dragon tradition. Hordes of random nondescript dudes. Take that, Captain Snow. I know their NPC names that you can use in multiplayer. Because I played this game way too much when I was a kid. Well, not enough. I'm going with not enough. Well, I pretended that I actually worked at this dam and just stood at that control thing for hours. But that's Going back me. to the sheltered life thing. <laughs> you know, yes. Uh, Adam, bless him. I'm being sniped at, aren't I? No. Yes, there's a sniper up there. I think I just saw a bullet whiz past my eyes, so... Take that, Captain yeah. Snow number three. What? I think it's number three. What, really? Should I keep track? So is that a mission oh. objective, or is it a secret it, bonus? Stuff? It's just a tertiary objective. I don't actually know if you have to do them on normal difficulty. You don't have to on easy. And I can't remember on hard, but I'm assuming on hard you have to do them all. I'm just doing them now because, well, you know, part of the routine. I believe on easy you didn't have to do them. Normal, you do have right. to do Right, what do we remember to do this time that we didn't do in the practice run? Destroy the dish. Blow up, then. Come on. Yay! Yay! Oh. Oh, you were hoping that the dish was going to fall They weren't on paying their satellite TV you. license. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
You know, there's a lot more sneaking around and less enemies than some of the later levels. I should have really done this on hard then. Yeah, and I just burnt myself by event because that's how I roll. Steam! They have a sale on Steam. Not anymore. You've got they lots don't. of free Steam. And, ooh. Uh. Camera. Missing the camera. Aww. Sad camera. Sad camera is sad. Okay, ooh, there's a guy. Shoots him in the back of the head. Like that, yeah. I'm a stealth operative. Taken control of by some time jumping dude with dodgy eyes. Vin Diesel. Yeah, Vin Diesel. Well, not the real Vin Diesel. He's pretty cool, actually. He would have played a great part in this, though. <laughs> now, now we, time splitters the movie would just be pitch black, surely. And we have the KF-7 Soviet. I mean, the oh, oh my Soviet S-47. Is that a valve? They're, they're looking that way. Is shit happening over that way or something? Well, not really. They're looking at some steam pipes being all impressed. Oh, oh, I always look at steam things and I'm impressed. Oh, well, you know. Look, <laughs> a valve. Right. Ooh, are we, how far are we going to flog this joke? Really? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's better than a crank. Crank? Yes. Crank? I don't even. Resident yeah. Evil. Okay. Well, at least you don't have to find oh, it. No. Oh, Ste no. Steam pressure's at zero. Shit. That means no more online games for you. Oh, well. Oh. Merry Christmas. Steve just ruined it for all the PC gamers. Yeah. You Grinch. <laughs> I'm kidding. I love PC gamers. Oh. You picked up the uh, armor, right? I have no idea. I'm going to be a nice, friendly person and shoot a person in the back of the skull. Did she just salute when you shot her in the back of the it's skull? That, um, she had a very bad uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, Now, now, now. It's no time to play games. Wait, what? Bye. Now, does this have the weird aiming system like you had on GoldenEye? Where well, you hold the button to aim Where well, you have to hold it and move it around. Yes, and... it, uh, it oh. is fundamentally identical. Time that was, that iron was the main thing I hated time about Golden Time Splitters does not have iron sights, I don't know. It's a totally no. different system. Time Splitters is equivalent to iron sights. Uh, it predates it, I think, in terms of an extra alternate Aww. system. <laughs> I will not stop the camera is sad. Oh, another... Oh, she I, saluted. I am a hero. I just shoot people in the back of the head. I am the good guy. Really? Why don't you believe me? And yet you're murdering innocent possible well, I people. I think the... the the actual player I'm playing as who I've taken control of is actually here to investigate and remove evidence or some other evil stuff. A spy? Yes. Uh, why don't we say a spy? Like like a like a British spy that would be in a film wearing a suit and not call <laughs> James Bond. Um, okay. Double O were. Double O were, yeah, why not? And uh Aww. God. And um definitely not doesn't say chime splitters. Aww. Chime splitters. No, no, no. no. Um Time crystal located. There's not as many weapons available on each level as there is on Gold Knight. Like, you can have a cheat to have all the weapons on on Gold Knight at once. Cheat? Uh, I don't think you can only have like up to five. I mean, even when you're building levels or setting up multiplayer weapon sets, which is a shame. And uh, Easter egg. And by Easter egg, I mean actually an optional little thing and an anaconda cart for my uh, scanner. I, I recognise that cartridge. It looks similar, but not identical to another fucking Captain Snap. I mean an N64. <laughs> I think the ladies, the uh, the ladies with the blonde ponytails, they are Lieutenant Frost, I believe. Lieutenant Frost. Can you stay around there long enough to go for a flight? Oh my god. She... It is funny because sadism! Um... Yeah. I'm gonna get caught. Ah. I have no idea if okay. I got caught or not because the volume is on that low. <laughs> um... We shall see. Destroy vital uh, The gunshots kind of indicate I might be in trouble! Weapons, Steve. Weapons. Looking completely in the wrong direction there. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't well know, attribute these to have the soldiers. best NPC enemy, I mean, enemy AI. They're a lot better in multiplayer, in my opinion. In single player, they like have to take damage stances and take all these cover things. And I think... Flashing boobs. Flashing the bombs, Adam. Yeah. But... Bombs. There's one file cabinet remaining. Lies. It says burn all the evidence in the cabinets and it's complete. So, nah. I mean, oh. Ooh. My mission was a success. Ooh. Oi, were. Did they? they... Aye. Shoot me in the butt. Yes, boss. Oh my god, really? He's taken two rounds to both cheeks. I asked you a question. He, I, <laughs> I just took a grenade to the face. He has, 
He has more arseholes. Steve, why did you go for the sniper rifle in this situation? Uh, it's a cycle on your weapon switch thing. Oh, okay. It's not an easy thing to choose. Um, yeah, on the Half-Life video, I was just so confused with the um, the Xbox weapons selection thing. I could and destroy it's... the cameras. Or I could destroy just that, you know, the video feed as opposed to the whole guns. There was something I got with that. I don't know. Okay, hit switch. If you're wondering and getting quite lost as to where we're going, I'm about to run through a window. That, That's hey, not there smashed. anymore. Shit. Oh, there's one there. Okay, when I go back to that room, which I will have to, I'll do the whole 80s action hero thing and barrel through a window for no apparent reason. Unless. Unless I feel compelled smashes. to not do that. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, you've got to riddle him through with bullets, not just this one. Oh, okay. Start from the foot now. Oh. I thought you physically shot him in the foot then. He just picked some dog shit off his shoe and then took it into his face. He gets crotch shots until he dies. And holds his head. Right, now. No, doesn't work. Clearly bulletproof, right? Clearly bulletproof. All the computers. I don't even know how that's possible. That is rather strange coding, right? Make a smiley face. Oh, okay. And look, they're, they're dead. Opening all of the doors. Yeah. Or both of them. Stuff is about to get real. Do you remember how the original of the, the video, the FMV that started the mission went? Well, it's all very... Hey! He's just flailing angrily. And um, the dead walk among us. Shombies. Oh my Steve god. Steve in a zombie game. game. This is not unheard of, let's face it. What? That's unreal. Yeah, I know. Oh. It's, it's totally surprising. Wait, was this on the Unreal? No, it wasn't on the Unreal Engine. No, it? That joke it... doesn't work, sorry. I'm not sure what this was built in, to be honest. It looks like it may have been just using some of the standard PS2 firmware stuff, but that could be wrong. It has been known to happen from time to time. Time, time splitters. Yes, time splitters, time. I don't know, I'm rambling, leave me alone. Um, zombies. Yeah, there are zombies loose in the building. That's not normally a reassuring thing. Actually, one point. How's this outbreak started? Uh, they were experimenting on a thing we haven't seen yet that I'm going to blow the fuck up. Okay. In the uh, yeah. extrapolated narrative that Steve has no idea, is just winging it. And as promised... <laughs> that, 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 that seemed a lot more badass to a 10-year-old Steve. I'd say 10-year-old, probably more like 15. More, more dramatic. Yeah, more dramatic. Yeah. So the zombies on this, are these proper shoot the heads off them zombies? Uh in Time Split is one, yes. There was Time Split is two, no. In Time Split is two, you could literally just physically abuse them until they died. I always find it fun when you can shoot limbs off things. Yeah, you can pop both limbs off and their head if you're feeling particularly sadistic. Which is always a nice way to go. But in this case, I'm just gonna give him a present. Oh they literally that's Look, knackers! That's all kinds of fun that I've just discovered. See, that one died and its head was still attached. Hmm. Chest. Oh, if you can get another one, it'd be awesome. Oh. I it's gonna blow. running away. So, yeah, it's gone awfully quiet. It's my impressive disposal of zombies using egregious that timed is... mines. Yes. Oh, shit, there's another one. Okay, just. I'm, I'm determined to get one attached to a head. Okay? Go. It will happen. It won't happen. It will happen. It won't. It won't happen. <laughs> but yes! 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 Only it won't explode in the first. KO, motherfucker! Ow. E. That that does look like it hurt. Yeah. Oh, there's a there's a green thing. That's the time crystal. Ooh. It's what um, Sam Beckett. You know that Vin Diesel character's name isn't Sam yes. Beckett. But um, he's kind of in my uh, character's current body four. He's looking for the time crystals. Because they control a time machine, and that will stop the time splitters from destroying the world. You see where this goes? A lot of time stuff. Okay. The whole time travel setting basically allowed for the developers to do lots of different daft settings, yes. different weapons. Is um, Vin Diesel's motive then that um, he actually has a herb garden that was destroyed and he lost his whole crop of time? <laughs> no. No, no. It was a case of trying to save the universe and the human race is at the end of the brink of annihilation, as it tends to be in these science fiction-y games. Okay. 
Okay, so why not use the time crystals to go back and stop the time crystals being created for time um, purposes of things? Because Par that would be a good question. Uh, Adam, Anthony, say things. Uh, Paradises, because you're using the time crystals to stop the time crystals being made, so there wouldn't be any time crystals to, for you to go back in time and stop the time crystals being time crystallized. And also... What? What? There, what? Are, <laughs> there are aliens... No, sorry, there are zombies and... Guardsmen, is there any infighting amongst them? I have no idea, but now for a brief commercial break. Oh, for the low. So they've just stopped mid game. I have no idea. All I know is this is perhaps one of the best little mini games ever. I used to play this for hours too. This is only the only mini game in, in game. There's the game. three there's a go kart one and a Lunar Lander one. No, as in general games don't always have mini games in them. Oh, I don't know, there's a lots of daft modes. I mean, Time Splitters is known for its multiplayer, really, and all of its vast modes. Uh, uh, Name uh, another game that's got something like this in it. What, that you can just randomly do on the fly? Yeah. Snake on the Nokia phones. No, I meant... Uh. Name another console game that you can play, but also go into another game, mid-game play. Well, I'm sure there's that you can can do that. A, a console game that you can play another console in during your game. Well, <laughs> yeah, like Steve is doing right now with his snake game. I'm only, I'm, I just want to set a new record because I did really piss ball when we did the trial run. Well, if you can beat 10,000, you beat the entire scoreboard. I'm not going to play until 10. <laughs> no. You jinxed me! <laughs> you jinxed me! That is exactly the, oh no. It's I am less. no better than Cortez, Hart, Elijah and all the rest of those people. You didn't who, even beat yeah. your high score. I did, I did. <laughs> didn't I? Oh! oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Jump scare. Right. Thanks for waiting for us, by the way. Headshot. Boom. That's actually meant to be tomato sauce and raspberry jam, by the way. It oh. says so in his character description. Really? Yeah. Cool. They don't really eat brains. They're vegan. Da -da 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 and that random voice over my shoulder suggests we're recording. Um, Are we? Yeah. Oops. Lord? Uh, oh. It wouldn't be technical difficulties without fire button, or it wouldn't be fire button without technical difficulties. I don't know, that man's getting punched to death by... Burn. Like Kill it with fire! Uh, it's super effective! Yourself... Can you set yourself on fire with the fire? Yeah, I can if I give this man a hug. I then scream with agony and need to quickly sprint to some water source. In this case, conveniently place shower. Why don't you just use the fire extinguisher or haven't you got that equipped? You know, I actually totally forgot I had a fire extinguisher. Can you use it on yourself? <laughs> yes. No, I can't. I don't think Point I can to actually the... immolate myself. Point it <laughs> to the ground, I believe, but don't quote me on that one. And melons. Yes, melons. There's a thing we like about melons on this game. Explode them. Now, if I write, this should blow it all over me, right? No. They take forever. No. That was rather... Delayed. Yeah, disappointing. Physics. Don't. I think, this, don't. I think this physics. slightly predates. Oh. I think this predates the um, what do I call it game? That game that we did recently on Fire Button, um, Half Life Two. Uh -huh. it's yes, it's going to. It's. It <laughs> might. Me I got that. Guy, probably contemporary yep. to the original Half Life, I guess. Mm, uh, I believe uh, Time Splitters One came out after. Oh. The original Half Life, so I could be wrong on that one. Anyway. More decapitation and oh for fuck's sake! Fire button. We check our facts. No, we don't. <laughs> wow, a floating head. Yeah. In um, Time Split is three. There was a grapple gun style thing, which knew that you could grab things and manipulate things. We called a vortex manipulator. So chances are, by then the grapple gun had had its like big hype and payday. Yeah. Um, the gravity gun wasn't until, until Half Life Two. Yeah, that's what I mean. It oh. may have been around the time of Half Life Two. So now we hit the switch and we wait. Why didn't you just take the elevator up from where because you were? Because the game doesn't let. Oh, the game does not let me. It usually goes down and picks up some zombies. I'm not complaining, you know. <laughs> Speed, haste, and and big guns and chopper. Chopper. That'll be a, that'll be the chopper to get to, right? <laughs> okay. Hang on a minute. Uh, that chopper looks suspiciously familiar. Is it a hind D? It does look familiar to liquid, but I think it's just inspired by the uh, Hind D. It was so popularised in video games by. Why wouldn't you shoot thing. the guy that's shooting at you? Oh, because uh, missiles. Yeah, yeah. So did you uh -oh. shoot the missile pods off? I did. I fractured the missile pods, and now it's just got a pistol, machine gun, and 
it's still kicking my ass. I'm on normal. I used to be able to beat this game on hard with no real problem. It's kind of disappointing. Yay! Die, you. Pro tip. Shoot it until it dies. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the portal. Is our ticket out of here. Completed all objectives. E no, we haven't flat down. Yes, yes, we have, Adam. Thank you for slowing the video down. Thank um, you. You're welcome. All right. And now we leap through the time portal and boosh. Complete. Time to watch our portal video. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. And um, this was just a brief foray in a slightly snowy atmosphere with zombies for five. It's Christmas. Or has been Christmas. Oh. Or maybe the middle of June 2014. Okay. Um, Happy New Year. Bye, guys. <laughs> bye. Sega.